So like the reality is I had no idea that what I'm doing right now that has gotten me to the financial success that I am, I had no idea I was going to get here. I mean, this is the funny, I remember the first conversation I had, like, you know, he already made a million bucks and he's done really well. And what he, this is what he told me when I first started learning the skill of managing email lists. He said, um, follow the money. So it's, it's one of those things where like, f that's really what it is. Follow the money. Um, maybe you want to follow your passion, right? Maybe you want to do something that's not money related. It just depends on how it depends. At the end of the day, it just really kind of comes down to how, what's most important to you, right? So like to me, like one of my biggest influences was the four hour work week by uh, Tim Ferriss. And then many of the books in that similar space of entrepreneurship have always been around that. And because of that, I wanted to like find a way to have work freedom or life freedom. I wanted to work from anywhere in the world, which interestingly enough is like basically easy to do now. You can work anywhere from the world now because of the way the internet's set up. But back then it wasn't, remote work was not quite um, typical, right? And when I really got into it and really started learning about marketing and stuff like that, I didn't know what I was doing. You know, I just had a sales job and I just, I worked, you know, I, I worked in my career. I, I climbed up the ladder and I, I became a manager and I, and, but I still did some stuff on the side. I read lots of books and I, I read a lot of audiobooks and listened to a bunch of things and I, I bought courses. Like you kind of have to know yourself to some degree to what, what it is that you like, what you don't like and what's important to you. You don't have to be super specific of like what industry, but one thing I do know for sure is that I did not want to do anything boring.